kind of talk about what is the power grid? What do we mean by that? So when we talk about the electric grid, we're really talking about uh, something a little bit more complicated than you probably think about it. It's not just this line that connects your house to a power plant. It's a circuit. It's power plant connected to homes and businesses and all the people that use energy and then back around to the power plant again. And you have to have that complete circuit or the whole thing won't work. Um, a lot of times I talk about the car grid being a lot like a lazy river at a water park. Because you have to keep taking things around in a circle like that. Yeah. And like the lazy river, the grid also has to function within certain parameters. So you have to have the electricity on it has to be moving at a constant speed, which is kind of an analogous to what electrical engineers would call um, frequency. And it has to be moving at a constant depth, which is analogous to what they call voltage. And the way that you keep those two things in line is that you have to have an almost perfect balance between supply of electricity and demand for electricity at any given moment. And if it gets out of whack even by a fraction of a percent, you get blackouts. That doesn't sound so bad. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> you know, lazy rivers are fun, and you know, blackouts, I think, only seem to happen when everyone decides to use their air conditioning at the same time. So as long as some people are hot and some people are cold, it'll be OK, right? Uh, no. Um, so the problem with this is that the way that our grid is set up, we don't have any storage in our electric grid. Uh, you know, the batteries that you're used to having in your life, in your car, in your gadgets, those don't really exist at the grid scale. Or rather, the batteries exist, but we don't use them because they cost millions of dollars or the size of a semi-truck and have to be shipped from Japan. Um, so instead, we have these guys that uh, work in these control centers all around the country. And they work 24 hours a day, seven days a week, making sure that that perfect balance stays maintained. And this isn't just a day by day or hour by hour kind of thing. It's every five minutes, things get updated and they have to uh, readjust. It sounds kind of like a seesaw, where they're yeah. kind of shifting over and then, oh, no one's going to tip over, then no, 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 they go back and do Pretty much, that's exactly what they do. 